today we're going to be talking about the competency of interprofessional collaboration between nurses and pharmacists concerning the older adult. So some of our concerns are that when patients are getting discharged and sent home, they're going home uneducated about their medications, and when they do fill those prescriptions, they're not remembering or understanding everything the pharmacist says. There also may be some inappropriate prescribing, and they're not satisfied with their education. So a study by O'Connor et al. about inappropriate um, prescribing says that it won't this can't be fixed by prescribing criteria alone. It needs to be a collaboration of the doctor actually telling their patient what they're being prescribed and then the pharmacist to actually do the expert review of all their medications so there's no interactions. So as nurses, it is our role to ensure that doctors are educating their patients on their medications and that the pharmacists are completing this review. Um, a study by O'Connell about patient satisfaction and education. Um, there was a study done about the brown bag medication review, and so this is an opportunity for older adults to take in all their medications that they're taking at home, including over-the-counter drugs and vitamins, and where they sit down with their pharmacist for an inter a 45 minute interaction, um, where they discuss the medication information, different side effects, and drug um, interactions. So the results of the study showed that patients were more satisfied, um, that they felt and understood their medications better. Um, so we need to promote that they can use to the pharmacist as an opportunity for this. Um, and some final thoughts as nurses, we think it is important that the older adult understands their diagnoses and that they and why they are prescribed these certain medications so that feel they feel empowered to take the charge of their own health. Um, especially in our own clinical setting, it is important that when we're actually giving a patient a medication, that we're giving them that education so that when they hear it again from the pharmacist, it's not the only, it's not the first time they're hearing about these meds.